For those of you who don't know me, my name is Emily. Um, I'm a textile designer, webcomic creator, um, and kind of wanted to do an unboxing of something. So um, I'm just I'm going to cover up my address. I'm just basically, uh, I got a really cool package today um, from the Tiny Hands Company, which I don't know if you guys have ever heard of them before, but they look like they're a pretty cool company. I'm really excited to like check out and see what I got. So yeah, I love how the package is pink. It's cute. Anyways, um, even though I'm wearing like a dark <laughs> dress, um, I still have a little bit of Quinn in me. So uh, I do like pink <laughs> and purple and blue and all those crazy fun colors. Um, okay, so I'm gonna just unbox this or unbag it, I guess it, it would be. And I'll show you guys what I got. So I got like six pieces of jewelry from what I remember. I'm also going to like smell them all. I think they're all uh, supposed to eventually, like the, the smell is supposed to fade over time. Um, packaging is super cute guys. Uh, so it's May, May Pack, I believe her name is, who does uh, tiny hands. I got about six, I believe. Yeah, so they're all so cute. Oh, just a little receipt. So they're all basically like um, wrapped with like so, sort of like a doily and a ribbon. And obviously this is bubble wrap. So let's see what this first one is. I will play with that bubble wrap later. Oh, oh. So... This is cool. So I can actually see what they are on the back. How cute is this little box? Um, all right. Oh my God. So I'm so excited for this. Um, so my grandma used to make cookies every year and I actually kind of went on a journey to sort of find some of her shortbreads. I don't know if you guys can see that. I was trying to find her shortbread cookie recipe because um, something happened to it, unfortunately. And uh, little did I know that my older brother was kind of on the same quest, but I was, I basically made um, a textile pattern of, of different cookies and stuff like that. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh, I did not expect that. I thought this was going to smell more like vanilla or something, but it smells more Christmassy and like almost like gingerbread. Oh, that smells so good. So these are all apparently made out of polymer clay. Wow, it's so detailed. It's just beautiful. I don't know if you guys can see this very well. Oh my God, they're so cute. And they kind of like, they have the little silver balls and everything that my grandma used to use. Um, so I'm very excited to wear this around Christmas time. Hopefully I can make like um, sorry, I was, I was interrupting my story, I think. So, um, I made some tea towels for my relatives, um, with, uh, what I thought was and hoped was the, uh, cookie recipe. I hadn't actually made any cookies yet. So I like put the recipe on a, on a spoon flour fabric and then sort of got a bunch of all the fabric, um, with this recipe on it. And I cut it up and sewed it, um, to make a tea towel to give out to my relatives with some actual cookies that I baked. So I basically baked the cookies after I made the tea towels, which is kind of crazy, I think. But um, it actually turned out, luckily it was, it seemed like the recipe, like my brothers were like, yes, this is the recipe. Um, so I also made a gluten-free version of it as well. Um, but yeah, this is so cute. I can't wait to wear this around um, Christmas time. And the same pattern that I put on the tea towels, I'm gonna try to make a cookie dress or something, I think. So I'm really excited about that. Um, so cute, I can't wait to wear that. Okay, so, I mean, it's not Christmas now. Maybe it is when you guys are watching this, I don't know. But, that'll be really fun for Christmas time. So, I don't know what this one is. I didn't read the back of this, so this is gonna be a complete surprise for me. I'm gonna try not to snip the ribbon. These little doilies are so cute. All right, so. Uh, oh! Oh, she put like a bunch of um, the business cards in here. So I could probably hand them out to other people too. So that's really cute. Oh, they're adorable. I just love this stuff. I think I got like three different cookie, <laughs> cookie 
cookie necklaces. I'm a, I'm a cookie fiend. I actually thought that I was a pie person. And then one of my friends was like, do you like this pie? Do you like this pie? And I'm like, not really. I'm like, I think I'm more of a cookie person. I have to say. Like, I love cookies. Okay. This is another holiday one. I am so wearing this year, this year. It's actually getting closer to to um, to Easter for me. And I have, like, an amazing dress to wear with this. Guys, like, come on. This is adorable. This is a chocolate rabbit. Oh, my God. I can't wait to smell this one. Mmm. Yeah, it smells like chocolate. Mmm. Yeah, it smells like chocolate. So this is like the retro. Ooh, stop, stop wiggling. Um, <laughs> it's an excited bunny. Um, this is like the chocolate retro rabbit that I used to get from the Easter Bunny all the time when I was a kid, and I miss those. I think that those are the cutest. So I'm gonna. I have like a damask pattern that I did with um, like chocolate Easter bunnies and eggs and baskets and things like that all over it. So I'm probably gonna wear that with this. I'm very excited about that too. Yeah, I'm making a whole bunch of different textiles and things um, just specifically for the holidays, just to get excited about it. <laughs> Gotta be excited about the holidays. All right, okay, this one's snipped a lot faster than the others, okay. I almost like hate to like unwrap this stuff because she did such a beautiful job. Somebody did such a beautiful job if it wasn't her. Um, I, I think she has a few people working for her, but okay. This is, I mean, everybody has to get this when they go to her site, I find. Um, I don't, I didn't even watch the show that this was on. Um, oh my God. Oh my God. This is my favorite scent so far. Oh, I can see why. Oh, I can see why people love this one. I got the waffle necklace. So basically I have a waffle pattern uh, t-shirt that I made. So it's just basically a bunch of waffles that are supposed to be like polka dots, kind of like this sort of idea, I guess. Um, it's just like polka dots. And yes, I did make this by the way, I made this um, pattern. Um, I'm not selling it, but I made it. <laughs> just wearing it for fun. Uh, so I do have like a, a uh, waffle pattern that I made and very much inspired by Stranger Things and I'm totally going to wear this with everything Stranger Things. I also have this. This is really cool. Stranger Things game, like card game. And it has like some Stranger Things here. I'm going to open it up. It is so cute. I like love this. It's like, um, I got this for Christmas. Ooh, it's like a toaster and like the cards are like waffles. So which is, I think it's so cute. If you guys like have seen this, like let me know. Um, I think it's like the cutest thing ever. Um, I have a lot of weird games and things like that, but that's one of them. Oh my God. Oh my God, this smells so good, guys. I wish I wish I could like, like waft this over, like pass this computer um, to your computer so you can smell this because it's so good. It's, oh my God, somehow, I don't know if I can smell the butter. I guess I can smell the butter a little bit in this too, but it's mainly very, very syrupy smelling. Oh, it smells so good. And being a Canadian, I love maple syrup. How can you not, right? Okay, all right, what is this? Oh my God, I'm so excited for this one. I think, I accidentally wrote the name, guys. Whoops, I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have looked at this. Well, maybe it's something else. Maybe it's a different kind. I love how, like, so I got, like, three different cookie things, and it says cookie right on there, and there's, like, a little heart. Um, it's just the little details, guys, that, that they put into it. They, like, even, like, hand wrote this stuff. You know, that's just so cute to me. Um, this is a handmade business, if, if you don't know about this. Um, oh, I love, 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 love. Oh, so many cute ribbons that I have now. Okay, yes. Um, another thing I'm probably going to um, use as a holiday. Ne uh, necklace. Oh, my God. doesn't smell as good as the waffle. Oh, the waffle is so good. It, smell it still smells pretty good, though. Okay, so this is... Um, do you guys see this? This is... Like, I love those kind of cookies with, like, the jam in the center. I think that they're so cute. So I love this, how they, like, kind of, like, made one that's got, like, a little bit of um, heart happening. 
and it looks kind of like sort of like powdered sugar I think it's so cute. I, I really want to wear this for Valentine's Day, probably. Or I think I could also like get away with it like if I was going to a tea party, which I don't do much. But guys, I, I kind of want to do a tea party at some point. I think that'd be really fun. You could like have these kind of cookies. Um, and then also, if uh, I'd probably wear this also with all my Alice in Wonderland stuff that I have. So because I think that the, I feel like that would kind of go with that sort of theme. So very, very cute. I'm going to put this back. Okay, I'm not gonna look at this one. Don't wanna look at what this is. I'm just so excited. I mean, there's only two left, so power of deduction. You know. Once I find out what this one is, I'm gonna know what the other one is. So I really, it shouldn't be too much of a surprise anymore at this stage, but. I'm going to surprise myself anyways, because I like surprises. They're fun. Oh my god, so cute. So cute. Okay. Oh my god, it's so delicately done. Um, I don't know if you can see that. There's a bit of a shine from this box lid. But, oh my god, it's adorable. I got a little fortune cookie. Eventually, I might make a fortune cookie pattern. Oh my god. It smells stronger than fortune cookie, I feel. Like, fortune cookies don't really have much of a scent. But it has kind of like a vanilla cookie-ish scent to it. Oh, that smells so good. The waffle is kind of like, I have to say, is in the lead for scents, though. And that's probably why it's like the number one seller on the site. I assume. Anyways. Um, I know it was on, what was it, what was it on? Parks and Rec. Parks and Rec was the show that it was on. So, just so you guys know. Okay, so I know what this one is. This one is not a sweet smelling one. This is actually a savory one. Um, I think, anyways. It's not supposed to be. If, if it's the thing that I, it's gotta be the thing that I know it is. Okay, so. And I want to wear the, this to the movies, and you'll see why in a second. Oh my god, so cute! It's popcorn. It's popcorn, guys. Like, how, like, how adorable is this? I, don't, I haven't seen a lot of people um, buying the popcorn, actually. And, so here, I'm going to try to focus a little bit better. I don't know if you can see that, but, like... Oh my god, this is so freaking cute. This is so cute. So, hmm. This one doesn't have a very strong smell at all. I guess it's supposed to smell like butter or something. Oh well, anyways, that's okay. Because I probably don't want it to have a super strong salty buttery smell, I guess, but... Yeah. So anyways, this is this is um, the last of my necklaces that I got. Um, I don- normally only wear necklaces for jewelry. They have other things too. They have rings. They have, I think they have bracelets. Um, I personally love wearing necklaces, so that's just me. But I am so, so excited to wear this. I can wear this with any of my movie shirts that I have. And then I go to the movies or something. Like I've got all sorts of Disney shirts. I'm like, you know the breakfast club shirts and all sorts of fun shirts like that um so i'll probably be pairing that with that sort of stuff but oh my god so cute i love it but yeah anyways guys check out tiny hands if you haven't yet i'm i probably shouldn't even be advertising for them they're probably doing extremely well um it's great for gifts for people like me who like likes cutesy things but also for people who have kids, if you're a mom or, or whatever, and you just don't know what to give your daughter or something like that, they're probably going to love stuff like this. Also, uh, my nieces, I'm sure, would like adore the set. Um, but yeah, so anyways, guys, that's, uh, that's my little haul video, and hopefully you guys liked it. Alright, take care. Bye!